Hello, and welcome to Tales of Glory. I exit our, our little castle here. This this game is excellente for some for some good fun. Let's do a custom battle here. Out in the clearings. We'll defend. Ah, and here we are. So this this game is a lot of fun because you can you can set up whatever you like over here. So we're gonna have two thousand guys are gonna it's gonna be a very unfair fight, but who, who cares? I'm just showing it off. And then you're gonna have Light infantry, trust go. Ah, yes. Oh, heavy infantry. Lancers. Archers, pretty self defensive. Skirmishers. Calvary. Then, uh, yeah, yeah, just to show it off, we'll, we'll start out on the easiest difficulty. You gotta hold down your, your menu button on your right controller and select things. Launch the battle. So here we are. As you can see, there's quite the armament to choose from. Uh, what you can carry is you can carry one shield on a hard point on your back. You can uh, carry two shoulder weapons. Those are weapons that require two hands, such as these pole arms, the battle axes, the great swords, or any of these uh, bows here. Uh, over here, these are uh, also two-handed weapons. These, none of these are throwable ones, I don't think. I don't think so, at least. No, these are not throwable. Um, but let's go with, um, we'll show off the bow, so we'll grab this as well as a quiver, this will have unlimited arrows for us. I do like myself a pole arm, pole arms are excellent when it comes to you getting, uh, swarmed. So I've hooked up both of my shoulder mounts at this point, one of these mounts and my, uh, shield, you can see it there. And that leaves room for one more thing, and I don't think I've tried out this hammer yet. I think it's a two-handed weapon, though. Is there a one-handed hammer? Ah, uh, I mean, I, I guess I could use... This looks pretty terrifying. I've got this. There we go. So now we've got a bow. I believe that's a mace, our quiver, and then our pole arm, as well as a shield. I'm not exactly sure... I guess we could use the shield with the face. And then over here we can change our armor. It doesn't really do anything other than aesthetics. You just kind of hit it and you become it. Let's be... It's uh... I like... Um... It's still loading right now, so... You can run out ahead and you can just start taking things. Like these, uh, there's points on this map that aren't any. There's like points where your guys spawn from. There'll be like flags like that, and you've gotta gotta stand near them until you capture them, and then that'll be a spawn point for your guys. And they'll spawn in waves. But if you press your uh, left menu button on a horse, whoop, whoop, there we go. You can control it like this. I can take out my pole arm, and Two-handed weapons will be a lot steadier and a lot. It'll do a lot more damage if you uh, actually put like a, a physical swing behind it, and you've got all that. I've also noticed that uh, certain objects will like vibrate and hit 
too many things at one time. I think when it goes into like harder difficulty modes, I haven't tried anything other than uh, moderate. I think it'll come out of your hands so you can actually get disarmed. Uh, that's happened quite a few times with my shields, because the shield will get knocked out of my hands. You can even take the, uh, the bow and use it while on horseback. And the mace with the shield. But, yeah. So you grab things off of your back with uh, your grip buttons. Oop. Or you grab things with your grip buttons and then you just kind of hold it. Uh, in order to like straight up just drop a weapon on the ground, you have to hold your grip buttons and your trigger. It's a little weird. But anyways, let's get this started. So I can either raise both of my hands like this so I can just ride forward. Those are my guys spawning in. Now, this initial force only lasts me so long, so I gotta be careful with it. And then all the horses I get after that have to be, like, taken from fallen enemies or fallen comrades. Let's ride in with these guys. The horse is based off of where my left uh, controller is pointing. So I can move my head and everything independently of it, but I can't move this hand over here independently of it. Makes it a little difficult for a two-handed forearm or something like a bow where you have to use your uh, left hand to aim, or I guess hold the bow. Look at them, they're lining up there. We got arrows flying in already. guys are just getting destroyed by these arrows. Oh, I guess it's time. There we go. Let's ride in on these guys. two of them. You run your, your pole arm through these guys. Oh, took his arm off. Help this guy out. Ooh, I'm gonna hit him. There we go. That guy should be... Oh, knocked him off his horse. game does turn you around a lot, so it does tangle up your cord quite a bit. careful charging through people like that because I could go down on my horse and then I'd be stuck amongst a group of them. I'm actually going to dismount over... Oh, my horse. And yeah, the friendly archers will end up fucking murdering the fuck out of you if you stand in front of So let's go into this with a pole. Guys. This guy helmets. 
so attacks to the head won't be super effective, so you can block me with this. There we go. God. Also, when this happens, you can get by by a bunch of other holy crap. I disarmed him. It's great. Gonna kill me. He's actually got the reach on me. Got one. They'll try and get around. <laughs> oh, shit. Ooh, yeah. Alright. Let's go. Oh, yeah. <laughs> He's a pet shit. Fuck you. Ugh. Ooh, I caught an arrow. Take their own guys out if they're oof. See the pole arms are super dangerous. I think one of the best weapons to use. Or are definitely one of the hardest things to fight. Oh shit, that's a lot of bacon. See I just dropped my shield because they knocked it off of me. I don't have a shield. Such a bad shot. There you go, I got him. Oh, right in the neck. What is that guy doing? There we go. Horse. Oh shit. Dude. 
because this guy charging. Ah! Oh. Got hit by that. Full arm time, baby. Ugh. This guy isn't going to be able to hit me. <laughs> and I can actually grab the shit that he just got hit with and fucking throw this. So. Oh. Yeah, that was a terrible ass throw. Holy shit. Yeah, okay. Let's pick it back up. Oh, I guess. <laughs> I love this. Give me this. I guess I can't pick that up. Hey, bitch. Yeah! Come here, bitch! Ugh. You can fucking punch them, too. It's pretty fucking great. I can stab him with this. Yeah, yeah. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch. Stay away from my guys. Disarmed him. Because I hit him so hard. And he still thinks he's got a sword. He's a retard. Can die, bitch. Oh, he's yeah, he's glitched. These archers over here, though. Fucker. Oh, these guys are protecting their archers. Well. Oh, Jesus. Jesus. The more you're hit, the more stamina you use when you try and run away. And the more you swing, the more stamina you use. Yeah, fucking fuck him up. Oh, Jesus. Oh, I just walked all back. Ow, there we go. I got hit that time. Oh, fuck your pull arm. Come here, bitch. Oh, two problems. I gotta be careful because they'll try and get behind me. Yeah. Keep them at bay. Just the pull arm is really good for. Oh Jesus! Ah, blocking is so cool. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, my friendly guys are gonna fuck up this pull arm. Well, the pull arm is definitely ideal for taking on the horses. Very nice. Actually, pick up this great sword here when he drops it. Swing that around a little bit. Where's your great sword? Oh shit! See the the enemies will like push you around, and so will uh, the friendly guys. So it's actually quite annoying I'm trying to move. Standing here, that guy got behind me. That's why I gotta keep moving. Look at that, look at how they press the button. Oh, Jesus, this is ridiculous. Oh, Jesus Christ. See, now they're all in front of me, they like spread out all around you, and that guy got right up in my face, and I'm almost dead, because I was just letting them hit me. You gotta keep moving backwards because they'll just push you around and do it. Oh, jeez. He's down, he's down. Look at that, he's just right into my face. Up. 
Come on, give it to me. Uh. Right, back in the center of my room here. This guy just standing around. You can actually command troops around. So if I do this, I hold down the trigger, tell him to follow me. He'll be following me. It seems to break after a while, though. If I try and summon more guys, it'll, it just won't work. It seems like a one-time thing for the most part. But now this guy will follow me around. We can go over here and avoid the archers and see if we can pull some guys over this way. Let's get these. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Oh, we're in the shit now. Oh, stay up, my guy. Yeah. Your goddamn great sword. Give. Yeah. Keep on grabbing arrows. Damage. Oh, you cheeky son of a bitch. Wow, the arrows are really powerful. Really fuck up some dudes with the arrows. The arrow dudes, because they're all trying to hit me. Pin cushions, I'm making pin cushions. Aha. 
See if I can't start just like pegging some of these archers that are over here. that one. This guy. Oh shit. Look at all the chaos. Be careful not to hit your own guys with the bow though, because it does happen quite often. Idiot. Give me that great sword. Jesus. Yeah, the enemy will like form up in like these waves and solo your guys, so they'll try and like break through each other's forces. The battlefield changes all the time. He's been completely disarmed, so he's trying to run away. So I can just route him by putting a nice little arrow in him. Come on. There we go. Now he's dead. See if the 
Oh, I don't get as turned around as much as with like the full armor. I need a melee weapon. It's a little bit easier on my core. Back away if you kill somebody, which is interesting. Yeah, our dudes are doing. That's right. Oh, right in my fucking face. You're getting one for that. Fuck you. Hey, you get him. That's right. in the eyes. Oh, I went through his shoulder. I'd say our guys are holding up pretty well. He shot me in the penis. Overrunning, we're overrunning them. I think their numbers are going down. Fucking dead. Just fucking him up. Yeah. I gonna come back down. There we go, and it gives you like your stats, how many people you killed, and all this good stuff. So good.